Hi, my name is Jennifer Atzberger and I'm a litigation attorney here with Margaret Wong and Associates. And today I'm going to talk with you a little bit about some of the work that I do with regard to defending individuals in removal proceedings. So I represent people who have to go before the immigration court with regard to notices to appear um, that are alleging that they are removable for various different reasons. And in order to defend against those cases, we have to submit applications that indicate an eligibility for relief from removal. One of the types of applications that you can submit is what's called a cancellation of removal application. Cancellation of removal applications are for individuals who have had a 10-year uninterrupted presence in the United States, who have good moral character, who don't have any disqualifying criminal convictions, and who have individuals in the United States who are qualifying relatives, often U.S. citizen children, spouses, or parents, who would experience extreme or unusual hardship if a person were to be removed from this country. And in order to submit an application for a uh, cancellation of removal case, one of the important factors that the court will look at to begin with is that tenure presence. There have been some recent changes in the law here in the United States as the result of a United States Supreme Court decision, Ms. Chavez v. Garland, which will impact who is eligible for cancellation of removal in the United States. Uh, it's a very technical ruling that has to do with defects in the notice to appear, which is the original charging document that uh, an alien will receive if they are asked to come before the immigration court to face charges of removability. And because this change in the law has to do with the defect in that notice, it's possible that individuals who are not previously eligible to apply for cancellation of removal are now eligible. And the way to determine whether or not you may now have eligibility for that is to contact an immigration attorney. And um, because this is the type of relief that many citizens who have come to this country with an initial illegal entry but have remained here for over a decade and have lives that they've now um, developed here in the United States and may have children who are U.S. citizens, this is the kind of information that can be really helpful to those types of individuals. So if you think that you may have that kind of situation, we recommend that you contact Margaret Wong and Associates. The phone number here is 216-566-9908. That's for the Cleveland office. And we also have other offices throughout the United States. And again, this is Margaret Wong and Associates.